Doop, 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 doop. I'm live. Stream manager. No, no. Hello there. This elevator is out of order. Sorry. Out of order for Carrie Uridine's guests, too? He's expecting me. Get out of my way, pencil neck. In that case, enjoy your evening. That's what I thought. What's with all the writing on the wall? Come on, I gotta pee, I gotta pee, I gotta pee. Where's Carrie? Pepe. Oh, yeah. How do I get down there? It's too crowded. That's behind us. What's Carrie Uridine's next mission? Hit on Kovacek? Very funny. But yeah, not about to let him get away with it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow. But the bastard's gonna regret making me sign those papers. You try to get out of that deal with the label. Ah, let's be real. Say I break contract. Then what? Who's gonna release my new tracks? Who's gonna deal with distribution, promotion? Influencers, media. Labels have got them all in their pockets. You're out with them, you're out, period. You'd be free. Seriously? Free to sing until you're blue in the face? Nobody hearing a thing? It's just another kind of cage. Show you one of my favorite spots in Night City. Come on. Don't come here often, but when I do, it's important. Should I feel special? 
Don't let it go to your head. Told him to shut the place down for the day. <sighs> Can't get enough of this view. Love looking at this city from above. You fall asleep thinking you're special, then wake up knowing you're no one. Sometimes wonder if I'll ever see anything more beautiful. I have. Doesn't matter, though. Night City's not something you ever forget. It just doesn't let you. I think I know what you mean. You ever feel like the city doesn't give you a choice? You either burn alive in it, or you never existed at all. Carrie, what's wrong? Tell me. Keep thinking about our conversation at Caliente. Us cracks, you and the <clears throat> slaves to the corporate right? Mm -hmm. In case I wasn't completely honest with you. Or myself, for that matter. Talk to me. See, thought I was afraid everybody think me another corpo slave. And I was just afraid I'd be in someone's shadow again. Again? Lived in Johnny's for years. Part of the scenery, machinery. Helping him shine brighter. Never believed I'd make it on my own without Silver Hand. That why he left Samurai. Fuck. But you did make it. Big, too. Only diehards remember Samurai now. You? Everybody knows your name. You think that changes anything? Wake up with the same thought every damn day. That I might somehow fade into this town's steam, stench, murk, for good. Night City's a city of shadows. And everything I could to walk clear of them for years. Fuck. Time you stop being afraid. Don't need to be. Think it's that simple? You'll be fine. Without me, too. Carrie's Fuck. gay. He doesn't like the pet. He doesn't sure like so. Should get back. Everyone downstairs is waiting. For you? I know, I know. In to knock back a few to this town tonight. And me in it. But I'm gonna stay up here a bit longer. You go ahead. Okay. See you, Carrie. See ya. We get to go do Claire's rescan. Santa Domingo, here I come. Funk. Excuse me.
Sixth Street Gang, you say. Gang ain't that tough. Claire. Me. Ready for the next race? Ready here. Ready and waiting. You want to use your own ride or am I bringing Beast? Beast. Time to unleash her. Unleash the beast. Can't keep a spit shined animal like that caged up in your garage. Well said. Meet there, yeah? Rancho? Be right there. See you then. It's not a bench, it's a couch. Hey, V. I'm gonna take a look under the hood before we start, and see if all's okay. But stay close. Just in case. This race has given me all the wrong vibes. Why is that? Got 6th Street, the mocks. Gangs are well repped. Just a matter of when a temper goes nuclear. It'll be fine, don't worry. Sorry, you need a minute to kick the tires before we get moving. Sure. Kick the tires and light the fires. Woo. Start your stallion. Let's go, clear. Come on! I want to smell that choo choo bird. Let him roar. Make my ears bleed. Oh, yeah, like that. Let's count it down. Three, two, one. <laughs> What up front, Liam? Luigi, after him! It's-a me, Luigi. Where's my brother Mario? Get it, 
six more checkpoints. We can win this beat! Who's stuck? Roll over, roll over, roll over. Shooting at me. Come here, get that guy. Three checkpoints left. Rocket in first. Ah, this ain't gonna work. I gotta at least get third. Fifth. Zero to try. Ah, uh, maybe second. Still qualifies for the next race. We did it, B. We're finals bound. Yeah. Don't stop yet, okay? Move up a bit further. We need to talk Before about how she wants to kill us. Going to talk. Something you should know. Okay. Oh, look at the moon. For a spell over there, okay. Wow. Quite the view. Yeah. Me and Dean. We like to come here. Wanted to tell me something? I mentioned Dean before. My husband, yeah. Wheel deer heat, right? Sweetest man I ever knew. We were friends before my gender transition. He brought daffodils to the hospital. It's a new beginnings, he said. Were you married long? Twelve years. Dean used to laugh that for our 15th, he said he'd finally talked me into my first implant. I was prepping some surprise. Mind if I ask why you don't sport any chrome? I love machines, V, I do. But I don't ever want to become one. Is that weird? A little, I guess, but it's fine. Dean. Only person who could have convinced me to chrome up. But guess we'll never know if he'd have managed, huh? Why tell me about Dean? I mean, I mean in, why now? He died during a race last year. The final. Not your standard fatality, though. You saying you feel at fault for his death? Me at fault? Why would you think that? He was flatlined by a Corpo Eagle Weasel. Peter Sampson. Exceptional walking rot. What's the Corpo's deal? Doesn't really matter. It was only ever another adversary to me. But to Dean. Mm. Dean and Sampson had a history going way back. Something happened to him? Dean never admitted anything, but yeah. Yeah, there was some kind of strife. Something personal to their rally rivalry. When Samson came first, Dean got hot and bothered. Your husband, how'd he die exactly? We'd just powered into the final straight, Samson peeling up the tarmac ahead of us. It was clear we couldn't win, so Dean let up on the chew. And then that snake slammed on the brakes. Dean also had to. He lost control. But isn't that how this race works? You don't get it. Road was clear to the finish line. He would have won. It was premeditated. Right, so this isn't business as usual for you. This isn't about winning. Well, that's right. Fuck winning. I want Samson Dead. I think I'm supposed Miss to talk her out of best plan for vengeance. Folks die on the track all the time. Won't seem unusual at all. Another day at the races, in line with the rules. And me. Guess you want my help to zero in. 
Killing Samson matters more than taking first. We have to make a choice. Sorry I lied to you, V. Means a lot to you, this. So yeah, let's bury the bastard. Thank you. This, it's important. I need it. See you for the final? That's right. Till then, V. Okay. Excuse me. Mm-hmm. Where am I? Where do I want to go? Sad gigs. check out a side job and we'll pause it there.